hello everyone and welcome to the next question in python hacker rank series over here in the series basically we are trying to solve uh, python solutions or python practice questions in hacker rank right so the next question which we are doing today is known as python print function so this is a, a question inside easy series so over here like let's just start with reading the problem statement right here right so as you can see in the problem statement they have given that there is an including stub which will read an integer n from stdin without using any string method try to print the following 1 to 3 to n so let's just say if they have given us an input 5 what you need to do is you need to print something like this 1 2 3 4 and 5 right and you don't have to write it uh, in new line so mostly people do this mistake that they know how to do it but they write it likewise uh, like uh, with the new line all the numbers in the new line but what we need to do is we need to just print it in the same line right to start the code what i'll do over here is i'll first create a for loop which will start from one and it will go till n plus one right what i am doing is i am creating a for loop with a range of one to n plus one and then just I have I just have to print the number i right now this will be uh, this will not be the correct output right because uh, the reason for that I'll tell you right here you can see that the number is three but all the outputs are coming line by line like one then two and three but what the expected output was uh, they wanted it to be in the same line right so what I'll do is there is a thing called end right inside print statement so i'll write an argument end equals to quotes right this means that all the prints uh, all the prints of i should come in the single line not into the new line now if i run the code you can see it is giving me the output one two three right so i'll just submit this code and see if it is coming right so all the test cases are passing okay thank you bye